This is one of several little limbs I'm going to be cutting down today. They're all about this size that are strewn around the yard. And I'm going to do it all with the Bakuma saw. Just an amazing saw. You can hear my neighbor using some sort of machine, but I'm doing it old style because that's how I roll the Bakuma saw versus gas powered and electric uh, machines. Hey YouTubers, Psych with Mike here of course, and I'm cleaning up a lot of the uh, storm damage um, in the yard. We had some wicked storms a few weeks ago, finally getting around to cleaning it up. I've been using this, it's okay, this is my when I take out hiking when I go looking for fatwood. A more hard core saw, and of course just pruners. But I found this really cool, it's amazing, it's been sitting in my garage several years a neighbor gave it to me and I've been cutting stuff with this thing. It's a Japanese made saw. It's extremely lightweight. Bamboo handle. It's called the Bakuma. This one is the 265. It's the best cutting knife I've ever used. This is going to be in my backpack from now on. Um, it just cuts so fast and smooth. It's just amazing. Um, this is definitely going to be my fatwood cutting and firewood cutting blade. It works much better than this heavy hardcore um, saw, so if you have a chance, get the Bakuma. I'm really impressed. You know, the more we rely on technology and machines, the softer we become, you know physically and in many ways mentally as well and we're going to be like those blobs of people and I think it was Wally if we rely too much on technology and not our own bodies and spirit and physicality I mean here I'm cutting this myself too with just perspiration and inspiration and hard work and I wish that was a thing that was important these days, but as everyone relies on the quick fix, they're forgetting that sometimes doing it more difficult and working with something more close to it um, and feeling the connection with it is much better than just taking a gas-filled chainsaw and getting it done in 10 minutes. So I'm kicking it old school and I got plenty of firewood for the next campouts, so it's all good. Well, I burned a lot of calories, and now I have a lot of wood to burn. Looking forward to several campfires this spring, and I have not lots of nice oak to burn. So the positive and the negative of the storm, the limb fell, it didn't hit the house, cut it up, and I got lots of wood for future campfires. So that's always good medicine. Bakuma saws for those who like to cut wood old school style. Bakuma saws cuts through wood like butter. 